Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Mal and in today's video, I'm going to be doing part one of a new series that I thought of, which is what are the best contacts for brown eyes? Now, I have tried hundreds of pairs of contacts. If you guys have seen my other videos, you know I have tried so many different brands, so many different types, so many different colors. And I feel like I have a pretty good idea of what the best type of contacts are for brown eyes. This video is gonna be all about the best blue contacts for brown eyes. And this is based off my own personal preferences and choices and options that I've tried. When I look for like the best contact, I look for something that's gonna completely change my eye color, that's still gonna somehow look natural, and that's gonna be comfortable. That is a huge ask out of a contact, but I feel like I've found the brand and the styles that really do that for me. So today we're trying four pairs of lenses. These are lenses that I've tested and tried for months now. So I'm super excited to do this. I actually have really taken a liking to blue contact lenses. So I don't know, it's just something that I feel like I was never super into before, but I'm not gonna lie, after trying these particular lenses, I feel like it's really changed my opinion on blue lenses for brown eyes. Let's get into it, you guys. I'm gonna start it with the first pair. Okay, so guys, this is one of my absolute favorite pairs of contacts from Zulotica. Um, These are Hydrochore Graphite. They are a yearly pair of lenses. And when I first tried them on, I was like, whoa, these are so bold. I don't even know about them, but I've had them for about eight months now. And they're the contact that I reach for when I want like a total kind of like change of my look. I don't think I mentioned this in the beginning of the video, but Solotica also gave me a discount code to share with my followers. So if you guys wanna get 10% off on any of these contacts, then use my discount code Mallory and it saves you some money. This next pair of lenses is the Natural Colors Collection in the shade Topazio. And I've mentioned this in previous videos, but I think it's important to mention again, with Solotica, the Natural Colors Collection is um, a little bit different looking than the Hydrocore Collection. The Natural Colors do have a limbal ring on the outer edge of the lenses, and the lenses themselves don't have as much of that like pure color. They have a little bit more of a peekaboo effect where your natural eye color peeks through. That being said, this collection of lenses is still really gorgeous, very beautiful. It just caters to somebody who likes a different look with their contacts. Personally for me, I actually am a fan of the Hydrocore collection. That is my absolute favorite collection with Solotica. However, if you love a limbo ring, then natural colors would definitely be better for you. And this pair of lenses is also a monthly pair of lenses. And the difference with the monthly lenses is that they, in my opinion, aren't quite as thick feeling. So for some people, actually, they may find that more comfortable. So Natural Colors Topazio is another one of the best pair of blue contacts for brown eyes because these ones are still really stunning, still really bold, but I feel like they do give a little bit more of that natural look and they completely transform the way your eyes look. The next pair of lenses I'm wearing are called Hydrocore Rio Copacabana and they definitely lean towards an aqua color but on myself I feel like they appear a bit more on the blue side so I wanted to include them in this haul. The Hydrocore Rio collection is gorgeous and I've tried almost every pair of lenses from that collection. They are the Hydrocore lenses that I personally love and, and adore, um, but they have some really fun colors and a little bit more of like bolder, 
colors that just have like a lot more pop to them. I tried these on about a month ago in a huge haul video that I did with a whole bunch of contacts from Solotica. And honestly, after that day that I tried them on, I have been wearing them every week. I have so many contacts now, you guys, it's ridiculous, but I keep going for these ones. I think the color is so pretty and it gives you a really nice aqua color, like I said, so it's like in between more of a blue and more of a green. Hey guys, I'm jumping in with a couple clips from a different video because I couldn't put this video together without including these lenses. These two next pairs are from the different collection of Solotica and they were so stunning. I actually wore them to the point that I couldn't anymore because they were monthly lenses. So what do you guys think of this color Arrera Blue? That is what is in my contact, <laughs> in my eyes right now. Um, this is from, like I said, the Aquarella collection. This is the Aquarella quarterly collection, a rare blue lens. And as I mentioned earlier in the video, they have no limbal ring. So, you know, some might like that, some might not. I personally love that. Um, yeah, let me get in a little closer and show you guys what they look like. And I also kind of want to give you my first impressions. I just can't see right now. So let me find them here. Whoa. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I could not see at all. <laughs> so I did not know what these looked like and I just looked in my little compact here. Wow, these are striking. Also though, I will say that like for me having really dark brown eyes, this has completely covered that. You cannot see a hint of my dark brown eyes other than right in that center where of course it needs to be blank so that I can see. Um, but yeah, you cannot tell that I have dark brown eyes at all with these lenses in. They are like striking really. What I'm noticing for my first impressions is that these ones have a dark blue, dark blue color on the outer portion of the lens and then as it gets closer into that pupil area, it has a lighter kind of icy blue. So there is a bit of a gradient going on which is really cool looking. I think it kind of gives them a little bit more of an intense look. Okay, my love, so this is the color Bossa Nova Gray in the Aquarello Quarterly Collection. And these ones are, as I predicted, a little bit more of an icy blue color. Um, I think they definitely would look gray on somebody with a bit more of a lighter eye or maybe a lighter skin complexion or lighter hair color. Um, like I said, all of those things do go into what makes the lens look the way it does on your eyes. Um, I actually love them, but yeah, what do you guys think about this color? Um, like I said, I feel like it's a bit bold for me, but I do like the way they look. I think in general, they definitely hide my dark brown eyes, which is of course the goal when you're going for a colored contact lens. You want them to potentially look like they could be your eyes, even if it is a color that's like abnormal. Um, yeah. There is something about like an, an icy bluish gray contact that just is so striking. Um, I am gonna get a little closer so you guys can really see what these look like, but let me know in the comment section what you think of these ones, the Bossa Nova Gray. <laughs> absolute last pair of contacts 
that I am trying on for you guys today are these beautiful ones. These are Hijikor Rio Parati. And again, these ones I tried previously, I think last month was the first time I put them in my eyeballs. <laughs> And you guys, I posted pictures and you loved them. You were asking me what lenses these were and what brand and what style. So I definitely wanted to include these in this haul because they do look a bit more gray, but when I put them in my eyes, they appear like a really beautiful, stunning light blue. These are another one of my favorites from the whole haul. And the reason is that I feel like they still look natural somehow while being so bold. I don't know how Slotica does it, but they produce such beautiful lenses that completely change the color of your eye while still appearing natural. This is the reason that Slotica is one of my favorite contact brands. contacts it really depends on the way that your hair your skin tone your eye color your undertones in your skin all of that stuff plays a part in how the contacts are going to look on you this is one of the reasons that when i'm purchasing colored contacts i always go on youtube and try to find somebody who's doing a review that maybe has similar features to me but again it always really depends on how they look when you put them in your eyes. As far as comfort goes with Celotica contacts, I find them to be quite comfortable now that I'm used to wearing them. When I first started wearing these lenses, I did find that the lenses were a little bit thicker and larger than I was used to. However, I have gotten much more comfortable with putting them in properly and cleaning them and kind of adjusting them to my eyes. And I personally find these contacts to be the most comfortable lenses now that I'm used to them. I also feel like my vision is extremely clear when I'm wearing these lenses, whereas some other colored contacts can sort of distort your vision. And um, I don't know, I, I just have never liked that. I also have prescription in all of my contacts, so it's pretty important for me to be able to see clearly. I hope that this video was helpful for somebody out there who was looking for a beautiful pair of blue contacts for brown eyes. Check out my other contact videos. They will be linked down below in the description. And for Celotica, don't forget to use my code. It's Mallory and it saves you 10% off your entire purchase. This is the first part of a series that I want to start, which is going to be what the best colored contacts are for brown eyes. So next up, I'm gonna be doing green, hazel, and then brown. Send your suggestions down below for what you think the best pair of colored contacts for green eyes is, as I'll be filming that video next, and I'll take your comments into consideration. Thanks again for watching, you guys, and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Bye.